Well, I've never been here, as you know, before. I did make a picture in Toronto, so I've never been to British Columbia before, to Vancouver, and I enjoy it so far very much. Do you feel that there's any kind of a gamble in doing movies uh, outside of the United States? Oh, I don't think so, not at all. In fact, I would say just the opposite. The last couple of pictures you've made that uh, have gone along pretty well, the uh, down staircase and the foxes, uh, do they make you feel as though you're really uh, running on the top of a wave now? No. <laughs> no, as a matter <laughs> of fact. Like <laughs> so you gentlemen uh, feel that you've got a good thing going, have you? Yes, we do. And particularly working up here, you talk about a risk of working outside of the United States. The cooperation of people here has been remarkable. Excellent. Uh, somebody mentioned just after that first scene was completed that uh, that was a very expensive shot. Could you explain that for the lay public? Well, we spent an awful lot, lot of money getting ready to make the first <laughs> shot. The rest of them get progressively cheaper. <laughs> There's one little uh, item that was kind of interesting. The reason for choosing Vancouver as a shooting place. Bad weather. <laughs> you wanted this kind of weather, yeah, we the, need the dark the... gray clouds. Right. How do you think you're going to like working under dark gray clouds for eight weeks? Well, I don't mind at all because I love the rain. I just spent three months in England and it rained continually and I like it, so I'm in good company.